This video explains development of pyramids and cone. Pyramid has triangular faces around it. Development of pyramids and cone are drawn by radial line method. Apex point is taken as center. And length of slant edge is taken as radius. While drawing development of square pyramid. The plan and elevation of the pyramid, with the given position, are to be drawn first. Measure the length of slant edge from the elevation. For obtaining the true length of the slant edge in the elevation, the plan of the same edge should be parallel to XY line. If none of the slant edges in the plan are parallel to XY line, we have to rotate and bring one slant edge parallel to XY line. Draw a line, and an arc with the true length. Measure the distance of base edge in the compass, cut consecutive points on the radial arc. Square has four sides, so four points on the radial arc. Join these points with straight lines. Join these points to the center of arc also. Finally draw the base, which is a square. Development of Pentagonal Pyramid The plan and elevation of the pyramid, with the given position, are to be drawn first. Measure the length of slant edge from the elevation. In this given position, the slant edge 4O, in the plan, is parallel to XY line. So the corresponding line, for dash O dash in the elevation, has true length. Draw a line, and an arc with the true length. Measure the distance of base edge in the compass, cut consecutive points on the radial arc. Pentagon has five sides, so five points on the radial arc. Join these points with straight lines. Join these points to the center of arc also. Finally draw the base, a pentagon. Development of Hexagonal Pyramid The plan and elevation of the pyramid, with the given position, are to be drawn first. Measure the length of slant edge from the elevation. In this given position, the slant edge 4O, in the plan, is parallel to XY line. So, the corresponding line, for dash O dash in the elevation, has true length. Draw a line, and an arc, with the true length. Measure the distance of base edge in the compass, cut consecutive points on the radial arc. Hexagon has six sides, so six points on the radial arc. Join these points with straight lines. Join these points to the center of arc also. Finally draw the base, a hexagon. Development of Cone Initially draw the plan and elevation of the cone. Cone has no triangular faces around it, so there is no slant edge also. Measure the length of generator from the elevation. Draw a line, and an arc with the length of generator. Since a cone has no base edges, the included angle, theta is to be calculated by the formulae. R divided by L, multiplied by 360, where R is the base radius of cone and L is the length of generator. Draw the other edge of development within this angle. Finally draw the base part as a circle. 